Hello everyone, this is Serious Trivia. Welcome back to the episode of our Legendary Dobao campaign. Pick things up for episode 25 from turn 119 in the spring season of 214. So last episode we ended by taking down Wu Ling, which opens up um, the option of giving land to one of our stepsisters who's rather defiant, let's just say that. Um, so with this army, we're not going to go deep into enemy territory just yet. We'll go slow. We'll take Cheng Wu along with the other three armies that we have here, and then we'll crush them, you know, methodically. Now over here, we are going to start trading land away, so let's do that. Yeah, she's uh, defiant. It's not good. Let's just say that. 13.4, that's not bad. Um, we can make up the points with cash. Uh, probably more than this. Yeah, just a little bit more. There we go. I mean, even if we're at 390, I still don't think she will stay subordinate for long. But I'm still going to give her all the land because um, I don't want to hold on to it. It's actually a bad thing for us to hold on to it. So, Wu Ling. Here, have more land. Ling Ling is all yours. Starting with the city. Ooh, that's quite a bit. Um. Doesn't have much, even after what we gave her. And taking that's kind of pointless. Ooh, this is tough. I can't get anything of value back. Hmm. I'll take cash. Come on. There we go. I don't think we have anyone in the settlement here. Yeah, we don't. Okay, but we're keeping that one. No one's here, right? Yep. Okay. So the rest of Ling Ling. We'll do both together. Oh, the value is weird. System makes a picker again. System doesn't believe that we're giving her, you know, three, four pieces of land at a time. This one's gonna be a little more pricey, probably 750. Or oh, even more than that, okay. Mm, this one's pricey. Trending towards 540. That's the best we can do. Alright, so if we look at the map now, you can see that our uh, very happy vassals. If we look at ownership, you can see that this group's here is a vassal, 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 us. We're going to take Zhang Wu. We're probably going to take Zhang Ke as well, and then Jian Ning. Uh, we're going to get some territory down south as well. It's pretty good land. Anyhow, we still have a bunch of armies to use, especially in the north. So, this is not our land anymore, so we don't really have to care too much about it. We need to kill off this force. Ooh. Okay, good thing we look. I know where they're headed. They're headed for this. Okay, so we come here. The problem is, he wasn't leading at the end of last turn, so... Oh, we've got to issue a move command first. Next turn, he would have the movement of this mountain. Alright, that's as close as we can walk. That's fine. Uh, we'll be fighting them next turn. We'll keep these armies relatively close to each other so they can help each other out. Atua's going to get destroyed. That's just a matter of delegate here. Man, it was our fault. We could have kept him as a vassal for a long time, but we decided to try our luck. Um, 
放他们回家吧。There we go. Yeah, we decided to try our luck and release them, see if we can get a cooperation out. We were desperate back then. It didn't work out for us. This would just be a pure food commandery. I don't even. I mean, we could grow into an income one, but I think it's better if it just stays pure food. We have 19k from all the battles, so let's just pump this up. Now we need to go slow here, and then this can take one more level. We need another one, but we're out of money. We still have armies, and if we have armies, we should be able to fight. And if we can fight, we should be able to make money. Meng Jie's group. Mm, who do we want to kill first? Shi Xie has more reinforcements, so I think we hit them first. Okay, that's gonna be that's also gonna be a retreat, but we can drag them up first. All right, let's wipe them out. Hmm. No need to actually fight two v one. We're gonna try to get more battles with Zhou Tai and all the generals nearby in case we can get more experience and also Oathorn with more people. Yeah, definitely cry the forest. We have a better horse for you, right? Hmm, apparently not. Alright, this shouldn't be an issue. We can try to chase them down. Not a guarantee win, but maybe if we give them some good stuff, we can make it work. We just need some strong generals to take care of the enemy generals, and we should be okay. Stone pig. Extra attack for everyone. And uh, we fight Hulaman. Right, so we technically have a superior force, but they're still giving us defeat. Hulaman is no joke, he's very strong. We have elephant, they have two cavalry, we have two tigers. A decent amount of spear units. Fire archers. Hmm, these are strong. It's mainly the generals. The generals are the ones that are really strong here. We'll fight them. Alrighty, so they're here, behind this pile of trees. We... I mean... I don't know if they have fire arrows, so I don't know if I should fight in the forest. Or else, forest is not so bad. These are our anti cavalry. Okay, all right. I am not going to get charged, I don't think so. Oh, I lied. Okay. Gonna move these guys to the Blank. He cannot fire here, or else he's gonna burn us. Is this an opening? Okay, maybe here.
Okay, they're not actually marching up. That gives us some time. What abilities do we have? Oh, pretty decent ones. Okay, what if we go outside the forest? shift everyone this way. Except for them. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Seesaw battle. That's okay. I'd rather them retreat back into the forest. That would be actually pretty good for us. If we go here... Move them up here. Wait, 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 he's in range. Oh, he was in range. Kill, 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 kill the general. Oh, he's trying to help arrow us. Oh, Herman, you are picked the wrong fight. Uh, I wish they didn't have units here. If they just all went for Herman, it'd be really good. All right, we gotta get out of the archer's way. That's our chance. Let's go. Flank up. You guys get into the forest. Charge that. Move up. Move up. Oh, all of you guys, you three, all move up. Uh, not our ideal fight. Hmm. Alright, you two sacrifice. Unbreakable. It's all good. Overwhelm them when they only have one general left. Fight. Go. Right out. Go this way. Lock him off. Mm, they can hold for a little bit. They're unblockable. Use your abilities. Use your abilities. I kill him. Stall. Don't overchase. Don't overchase. Stall. Throw yourself. Throw yourself. Alright, shoot them while they're being flanked. Come on, come on, beat that group down. Hmm. Take care of that guy. Come on, push. Alright, elephants bounce back. Oh. Uh. Very strong. Alright, not gonna duel them. 
I'm just gonna try to boost everyone's damage. Stall the generals. Use our generals on their infantry. Send you there. Kill that guy. Kill that guy. They have what? Recovery? Wow. Wow. Yeah, Hualao's Paragons have too much damage. Alright, they routed. Chanters? Have we allowed them to survive? Can you cut them off? Alright, they won. Let's bounce back. Come back, come back. Free up our guys. Did we kill the chanters? Almost dead. Alright. For her, it's fine. Don't engage, don't engage. Back off. Hey, army loss is kicking in. We did it. Yeah, Homan's really tough. Alright. Didn't have to be clean, we just had to win it. We caught him. Hmm. Yeah, I don't see a reason to keep him alive. There we go. Alright, resiliency popped. Get you some more health. Alright, can't chase, but Dalai has nowhere to run either. That might be all our armies. I think so. Now uh, we do have this situation here. Mm, we have so many generals. Ah, Zhao Yun in action. We don't have enough army slots to use all our generals. It's kind of sad. Like, we have no shortage of legendary generals on the field, it's just that we have so much more. Anyways. Alright, we do have a little bit of money now. Don't have any assignments that need to be done. Population's all still growing. This one's about to hit cap, but we can upgrade later now that we got more food. This one's just food. Speaking of just food, that needs to upgrade. Let's see here. We got Zhou Yu out. He just didn't join us yet. Now his purpose is non existent. He'll do that first. I still think at the end of the day we just disown him. Easiest thing to do. It's all our vassals now. Well, you have one job. Maybe two. You. Did he get anyone new? Nope. Did he get anyone new? 
Nope. Um, we could check for Zhou Yu. Because we already met him. But he's still on Shuxia's banner. He haven't joined anyone, right? He's not in anyone's pool. I think we'll get to see him. It's very possible. Alright. Let's uh, continue. Oh. They are trying to use their night battle to fight us 1v1. As though they can win the 1v1. Alrighty. So this one should be pretty straightforward. They have a lot of units. We have a lot of ammo. And I tend to use them. Alright, after we do capture that farmland, we are going to use the opportunity to shift our army composition. I do want to go back to maybe two trebuchets and four onyx dragons, now that we have them. And then we'll head down south to Pengcheng for reinforcement purposes. Come on, where are you guys? Maybe scout. Oh, there they are. Slow down. Welcome! Look at those Defender of Hebei, Warriors of Ye. Oh, well, most of those missed. Shame. Level 4. Gotta excuse our things. Alright, their cavalry is actually taking the side that I picked. The right flank. Uh, reload this slow? Okay. I'm gonna concentrate most of it in, in the forest here. Pull it back. Them. Any chance she wants to duel us? Oh, Lady Liu, you're brave. This would be um, Yuan Shao's wife. Hmm, impressive amount of cavalry. Too bad they're all melee calves. Yeah, he's actually reacting pretty nicely. They see the fire on that side and they're all shifting into this forest, which... That part is not so smart, but... Spread out, spread out. Point E2 on that one. Ooh, they got formations. We have double charge. Let's see who wins. Xiao Yuan, Xiao Dun, come. Oh, Xiao Yuan, come help. Xiao Dun can't come help. Xiao Dun is busy. Xiao Dun is busy winning. Alright, help, help, help. Ooh, infantry. That's not fair. Did we agree to that? Alright, get back on your horse and fight. I'll take care of that guy. Come on, push through. Get some fatigue points, it's okay. Ooh. Can't chase us. Here, auto fire. Hurry up! Alright. Charge back. Yeah, not worry about our front line. Alright, try to work on that. Ooh, no, you two do not pull away from combat. That's gonna hurt. There we go. That should be a rear charge. Some militias. Alright, now we pull out of combat. Actually, come here. Oh, no, I don't think so. Find a target. Take them out. Oh, we guys lost vision in the forest. No. Not too bad they ran to our spear unit. What a fool. 
Is he unbreakable? No, he's not. Okay. All right. The hammer envoy has completed. Except for a few, still needs help here. A little bit tough right here. There we go. Alrighty. I like how they charged out, but results not that great. My battle is deceiving. Healthy, strong, charitable. Execute. Okay. Yeah, the north is piecing out everywhere. Oh, vassalized. Ooh. Eat us to the punch. Yuan Shaw's getting a breather. Liu Bei's kid, I believe. Zhou Yu. Yep, he just took a turn. Our man just needed a turn. Here he comes. Now, maybe he worked for Faction in Between and is now a spy on us? That That's a possibility, I didn't even look, but... Let me double check. Nope, okay, okay, he just took a turn off. That, that's good. That's good, that's good. Zhang is actually coming to face us. I'm very surprised, very happy. He's got force, uh, nowhere to run, had to bounce back. I mean, if we can take down Hlaman, we can take you down, no problem. Oh, can we chase them? Nope. Can we get back to heal? That's not good. Alright, so I'm sure we can hop in and hop out. Like, I'm not even worried about this double team coming up. I mean, I'm kind of worried, but not that worried. Yeah, not, not that worried. We have a few unhappy generals, huh? What happened? You. I mean... You're just... Oh, uh, we're killing Death of Friends, rival faction leader. I could fire him. We don't need to keep him. He has no good traits. I mean, he's Meng Huo's little brother. Oh, our burn officer. He just needs to come out. He's too high level. Here. Hmm. Zhu Rong's husband? You married the wrong man, my friend. Hmm. I kind of don't want to say goodbye to him, though. Technically, he's semi-unique. Man, patrol commander is not good enough, huh? It's too much rivalry. Okay, he isn't worth the trouble. We have plenty of Han officers that we need to see on the field before he gets his chance. I don't want any faction-wide debuff, so off he goes. Get a guard. Kind of useless. That's who I'm looking for. Let's look at our stepbrother with Lu Bu's weapon. He's not heir, but he's the... Lady Feng's heir? She's also alive, huh? He's son-in-law. That's... <laughs> it's our daughter-in-law. Or sister-in-law? Right, because we're not Liu Bao anymore. They have no unique generals. Plus six anti-spying. Okay. That means we can do this. Let's chase her away first. Oh, we're going to get caught. Let's cancel then. We'll just wait for points. Plus 15. It's some insane defense there. I mean, I think Yuan Shu has that as a passive ability. 
Yeah. We're just going to take it slow, get the heal, take them out. They could use upgrade. A lot of these units can use upgrade. I'm just waiting for him to die. Why can't you die? It's insane. Alright, can we catch them? Okay, we'll catch them instead. On the march, but a full stack. This is not easy. Alright, luckily we got trees, but I don't think we have fire arrows. Yeah, that would have been more effective, but we'll take flaming shot. I think we just learned it too. We didn't have it before. Yeah, this is good. This is enough trees. Alright, these are two, these are one. We'll use this. Hmm, what do we want? I think side flanks can just be a little bit more casual. Our zone. Hmm. We need to scout. to lure them this way first. Oh, no, 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 fire, fire, fire. And to lure them this way, so they enter the forest this side. Fire, please. There we go. Can we loop them around? Back into the forest? I actually don't know how much influence we can have on their main troop. I know we can draw like a couple back. Maybe not a lot. I get a shot here first. Okay, if most of them won't go back. Then we'll just continue to set fire. Where's their elephant? I hear the drumming. I don't see them. Three more shots. Uh, wasted a lot of the ammo. Yeah, I hear the drumming. I don't see the elephants. See the boost as well? Ah, there they are. No burn officers, not high enough cunning, a lot of problems. Mm, kind of scratched them. It's the terror and the scare. Good. That should be scared of us. Wow. 
archer is going. Archer, let's start with some poison volley. Slow them down in the forest. Don't let them run out. Is the elephant? Uh, this is a little bit off. Oh, you know, the way the zone was drawn, it's kind of hard to block that slide. Poison, poison, poison. Oh, we drew the elephant back. Good. That's a win, actually. Because these infantry just does not stand a chance. Okay, I would like to draw the elephant this way, so they could, like, chase into that. Largely, oh, oh, we draw you guys a little bit this way. I think we kind of did it. Not sure, depending on where the elephant exits, but not bad. Elephant come out right here. We might see it. Hold on, I need to pull them back a little. Pull back. Oh, they, they stepped on it. They stepped on it. They stepped on it. Yeah, we killed half of them. Alright, kill the slingers. Flank. Oh, here comes those elephant daddies. Yeah, they routed. They routed. The terror worked. Okay, why don't you take care of this? Can't charge that one, but everyone else is fair game. Alright, stop poisoning. Gotta get some far away targets. Spread them out. Actually, take the generals. No rush, the front line can hold. Especially without elephants. Alright, you came and helped. So good. Alright, there was a problem. I don't want to engage the enemy infantry, so. We're gonna have to shift. Alright, you guys are gonna have to go up and debuff. Debuff, debuff, debuff. There we go. Go, go, go. out yeah squeeze by uh, I'd rather you guys not fight the generals I see what happens when they use one of those abilities he's unbreakable breaker formations as a matter of fact it's better if everyone just pull back you're in formation try to go loose and let the cavalry just flood her. Come on. There we go. One dead. One dead. Oh, you guys ran out of arrows too. Low cunning is a big problem here. Right. Still pretty easy. Relatively no casualties. Alrighty. Alrighty. As an elephant, but not willing to work for us. You. Retreated once. Ran right into them. And they're right outside of the city, so we can draft the. Uh, not, that's a lumber yard. Eh. Not a city, but. That way we can grab them out of the garrison. I don't want night battle. High? Why is this high casualties? Because they have a lot of men power? Alrighty, so obviously the main force is this one, even though... Hmm, how do we deploy the trebuchets here? Well, he's still against them. We'll probably use up all the ammo against them anyways, and then we'll let the archers, and also we have Fury of Beihai, kind of work together to wipe out everyone else that's coming in later. I think that's probably what we're going to do. 
I doubt they can get close. So we're actually going to set up the line this way. Cavalry can front charge them if they get close. There's only one anti-cav here. Also face this side. Mainly against you guys. Mainly want to hit that poor arm. Everything else we can just actually charge with our cavalry. Unless she's a bandit. No, she doesn't have that ability even if she is. Actually, this is a waste of ammo now that I see what they have. Mm, take the hill. Just defend them. Leave a little gap for the archers. Let's go have some little fun. As for these generals, not too worried. I'll fire this guy, and then we'll just charge. Yes, we're shooting a general. Hmm, the ability usage, and where did this general come from? It's a little bit concerning. But, their units are still garbage, and we should still be able to get them. Yep. Now it's just, don't let their general get loose to be able to charge our units, and we should be fine. What are you guys doing? My lack of micro. Alright, we got this. Kill the archers. It's only the real threat here. Debuff her, debuff her. Debuff all of them. Alright, kill her. Chase, chase, chase. Get the one in front. Oh, we killed one? Seems like it. Alright, you can chill now. Look at that health. Why the charge come through? Goodbye. Get ready to fire. You guys can also fire at will. By fire, will I mean fire here? All right, you get one, you get one. Fair game. Yeah, we killed all of them. Go over there. None of these garrison get to leave alive. Chase, 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 chase until they're all dead. you guys wait a little bit. Mm, we don't have that much kill threat here. They're not all hidden. You two idiots could hit. Hide. Oh, all the fun tribuches get to have.
Well, we have archers. We have Fury of Behai. They have pole arms, but they're... Ooh, not what I want. You chase that group. Can we break out? Or did we lose our horse already? Come on, just casually walk out. It's fine. They can poke you a couple times. No big deal. They're gonna rout soon. Gonna have to come over here and kill them. Fan out! Oh, they still have spearmen inside the forest. Hold on. Right, you two eradicate that one. Ah, uh, they got they got caught with this guy. Well fight them. It's okay. Their morale's cratering. Alright. We're gonna try to chase down as many as we can. Spread the target out a little. Ooh, you were on one? Yeah, we're not going to be able to kill all of them, but we can try. Three units not worth chasing. Here, relay, relay. You take over this bunch. They're not going to make it in time. Three, one. Or oh, they're going to be dead. Oh, no, no, no. He lost vision. Mm, we're not going to get them. They're still killing. That's a captain. Oh, that. Uh, making escape. 19, 3, uh, 19 is worth it, 7, 1, 3 guys, there we go, alrighty. Ooh, King Ear. This is also one of those events based on how uh, Joey's famous for music talents. And we have enough movement for this. Too bad we still have to fight it because we let 93 men go. And if we didn't have to fight it, we didn't have to waste all the movement that was on use. Can we still move, Zhou Tai? Yes, we can. Can't get them. Can't get them. They're pretty much trapped. Zhong Jian ranked up. Alright, replenishment for the unit. Alright, we're keeping Tang Wu ourselves. Right, we will have everything Tong Wu has to offer next turn. And then I guess two units go this way, two units go down. Seems to be the most balanced decision there. I'm more worried about the army popping out over here. That's what I think will happen. But we're not going to overreact. Right. Right. Oh, 
What? No, no, no. Alright, both of these armies are fixed. We're gonna hang on to this for a turn, just to heal, and also to maybe draw their attention to this, because I know they're targeting our land, and this is our only land here right now. So hopefully this will change that. Oh, I don't know if I dare to venture south by myself. It's probably wiser to take this first. Does he have reach? We did it because of patience, I bet. Alright, we'll try to take this next turn and then trade it away instantly. That's probably the only way to maintain this side. They moved. Everyone moved? Alright, I guess it is. That pocket of fighting, that pocket of fighting, that pocket of fighting, and they landed. This might be a dangerous position, but... Oh well, we already landed. What can you do now? Simon is on, Simon is on. Longshot needs commerce. This place might get taken. Okay, I think we spend all the money we need to spend. Everyone wants peace. Well, except for the Alliance War. Hmm. This is an interesting piece, because piecing out with them also piece out with Yuan Shu. That would make this part really safe. And then we can focus. We don't even have to focus on Gongsun Zan. Huh. I don't think I want that. I do. I, I want the fight, I think. This is the only piece of land that I, I would want. Can I trade for it? I mean, 74. I can probably vassalize him. 11.6. <laughs> oh, he really feels beaten down. I can just get the spice for free. Okay, this is perfect. This is exactly what we want. Even if we take his land, we would want a vassal there. So just by having him as a cooperation vassal, it'll be even better. And as a cunning diplomat, prefers peace and treaty. Mm, okay. He has a lot of family, but I don't really care. Do you have any of your chests? Nope. He probably has a lot of cash. Uh, it's not a lot, but we'll take most of it. Mm. Let's do 6,800. Nope, 7,000? Oh, right, he has. I need to go less, not more. Perfect. And everyone loves us! And we vassalize. <laughs> that was unexpected. You. Do you want the same treatment? Hmm. Silly you. Silly, silly you. Okay. We ignore them. Meng Huo. We still want his land. Yeah, we still want to fight them. The only question is, do we want to peace out with most of the north? The other question is, does he want an alliance peace? He does. Right. 
I think he would. We've been beating him up pretty much the whole game. Because I don't think I ever want to invade them. But then the chance to capture Zhang He is right in front of us. Not that Zhang He is super good in the game right now, but like... Yeah, I guess not like Zhang He is super good in the game. Because if we peace out with them, we can send them on Gong Sun Zan and then send them on them. I mean, they're going to fight us anyways. But just one less situation to manage. Because it's not like I want that. I'm never going to get this. Okay. I mean, imagine if we just peaced out with everyone. This will peace out with- there will be no one except for the south. And then our army sweeps south. While our northern army chills. <laughs> Wishful thinking. Okay, our vassals don't like this. Then we keep fighting. I'm down for it. Hmm, Golgan thinking about ditching... Ditching Yuan Shao, huh? He only owns a little piece of uh, land right here. So I'm not interested in seeing that happen. I'm just a little bit worried about Mach Halt. I don't want to split my forces. I'll let them take Loyang. I'll take it all back. I gotta protect my only outpost here first. Hmm. I think we're good. We have cash. This is no longer a war situation, so he would need to come to chase Dai Lai, which is something that he can do. We can't even march for that, actually. Alright, now let's continue. Oh? They're fighting us. I don't have points to extract, I guess. So I can't extract. This is the spy we put in Renshul's army. They did double team us. I have help. I have help. Whoa. Wait, wait, wait. What banner are you guys fighting under? I can't see, but Yuan Yao is Yuan Shu's son. He married him to this faction. And now he's helping me. I'll just take the delegate. I don't want to fight this. Not a lot of interesting fight. I hate it when there's an AI faction in the battle. They like never listens. And then you end up having to do extra work. I'll take medium casualty. I'm on friendly territory. This is Liu Qi. Oh wait, I'm wrong to do that. But no, I, there's no capture chance difference. Yeah, it's not going to be a big difference here. I'm not going to extract you. Go back. Wow. Okay, so not only... Did Yuan Yao help us? He marched his army in to fight the second army, the one without Liu Qi in it, which is great because Liu Qi is ours, and he crushed them. At least they, they both took damage. So now we are left in this very nice situation where we can just use our general with all, yeah, with, with uh, patience. No honorable, right? Yeah, we can try to use him to capture Liu Qi, get our get our stepbrother back with the weapon, preferably. And that's going to be the goal next episode as Zhou Yu has joined us. So now our strategist list grows even stronger. And we're going to try to send those armies out. I mean, we're really waiting on just the king rank. We're going slowly because we have to trade land away. Uh, but Gong Sun Zan is just going slowly because he's not upgrading his settlements. Or else he would hit it first. And then we'll have a three kingdom. 
It's gonna look like Gong Sun Zan for sure. Yuan Shao maybe, and probably one like Ma Teng or someone. I don't know about Corn. I give him a lot of land, which in hindsight right now might not be good. But even if he's one of the emperors, it's not a bad thing because we will never be an emperor. Therefore, we can still be in the same coalition. So it would be like us helping one of the Emperor Seed crush two other before backstabbing. That's not a bad situation at all. And that's where things stand. We have energy to turn on the south. Shixie has ready waved the white flag. And we'll get him this land and give it to him. Make him a good vassal. And then we'll get the rest of this as well. So that's going to be our goal. We did keep a piece that might not be so easy to defend. But once the armies come down... We'll probably just only need to send one, because it's not against the Man factions, probably don't need that many uh, manpower here. And then everyone else can shift this way to fight Meng Huo, while the arm one army that's done can sail down this way to fight Mu Lu. And that'll be that'll be that. And once we have the south, we can, you know, sweep up the northwest, sweep through here, and win the game. So hope you guys enjoyed this one. See you guys next time. Bye!